Meantime, the former Central Library in downtown San Diego will soon become a short-term shelter for people experiencing homelessness. The historic building has been vacant for nearly 10 years. CBS 8's Abby Alford got a one-on-one -on -one interview with the mayor to talk about the hurdles they've had to jump through to make this happen and support for the project. You can see City of San Diego work vehicles outside of the old city library and just over the fence you can see work is being done to renovate it in an effort to make it a homeless shelter. Some of the boards in the lobby area of the old central library on E Street and 8th Avenue are coming down to make room for a short term 26 bed homeless shelter. Uh, we're currently making some modifications to the building. You know, we, we, uh, a library is not the same as housing and so we have to make some modifications to make that work appropriately. We spoke with Mayor Todd Gloria today and asked about the cost. He says it'll run about $35,000 to turn the lobby into a temporary homeless shelter. But first, they need to do asbestos, mold, and lead abatement, as well as electrical, plumbing, heating, and door and window repairs. But one of the biggest hurdles is in court. Gloria says an 1899 deed required the building to be used as a library or reading room. But the mayor argues the new downtown library fulfills those needs. In the middle of a crisis of this nature, the fact that there would be anyone that would object to actually getting more people off the streets is baffling. Uh, but it is where we're at. Uh, and, uh, you know, I'm undeterred, but well, we're going to move forward. The historic marker sat abandoned for nearly a decade, and throughout the years, people experiencing homelessness have surrounded the building. Well, I like to see action, and this signifies some action. Michael McConnell's an advocate for people experiencing homelessness and says he's pleaded with the city to use this building to help people living on the streets, but cautions the city doesn't use it as a band-aid to the homeless crisis, rather ensure that there is access to affordable housing. Uh, the city likes to call these things bridge shelters, but too often they're bridges to nowhere. So they have to have a housing opportunity. McConnell says last month's homeless count in downtown was the highest in 10 years. 1,609 people living on the street. Well, shelters don't solve homelessness and they, they certainly don't work very well in San Diego. Only about one in seven folks who leave a shelter actually go to a permanent housing destination. The rest just cycle back to the street. The mayor says once they get past the first phase, they plan to deploy the old library building as a permanent homeless shelter, but expects to face a lot of red tape and spend a lot more money. Uh, I just simply will not take no for an answer. We will keep moving forward until we get this done. The mayor says that the shelter will initially open during inclement weather starting in November.